So I saw the matchstick rocket video from Grant Thompson, King of Random, and I was wondering how easy is it to make it myself? So I figured I'd try it. We're gonna try to make a match rocket that's seen in the popular video from the King of Random, Grant Thompson. All you need is some metallic tape, heavy duty, extra heavy duty aluminum foil, a candle, a piece of paper this size, a skewer with the end half of it cut off, and a box of matches. Oh, and a scissor. So here's what you need to do. Take a piece of heavy aluminum foil, heavy duty aluminum foil, and then you need to cut out a piece that's the same size as this paper. So. Just lay it flat over it and cut it out. It doesn't have to be exact. As long as you get the basic shape of the aluminum foil, that's fine. You can cut off any edges if you want, but this should work just perfectly. Then, take a match and cut off just the tip of it. And this is going to be our fuel. Okay, now what you need to do is take your silver foil, take a skewer, and lay it flat on top of it. Take your match head and lay it right next to it at the top of it. And then you want to tightly roll the whole thing end over end. Just like that. Keep rolling it, make sure it's tight. And now the important part, make sure that the top is squeezed really tight. And then fold it over. And again, just squeeze it really tight, just on top, to make sure that there's no air getting out. And as an added protection for it, take a small piece of silver foil, and put it on top of it, and tighten it up really well. For the last part, we're going to add a fin. So, take your aluminum tape, and you want to cut out a square, roughly about this size. Fold it in half once to make a triangle. Open it up, and fold it the other way to make another triangle and now just push it inward so that it sort of folds onto itself. You may need to bend it a couple more times just to get the line straight. There you go. Do you see that? Inward like that. Just let it focus for a second so you can see it. Yeah, again, you'll have the triangle right here. Push it in like that. Then, cut off the top of it. Open it up, and remove the paper backing on it. Then slide the skewer through it, and all you need to do now is seal it together, because remember, it's sticky tape. And you now have your fins for the rocket. Make sure it slides off, and we now have our match rocket. Take the match box, make a little hole in it, and slide your rocket through it. You could just use a lighter to light it from underneath. It's 
hot, so be careful, don't touch it right away, but that's what it looks like after it launches. So overall, I would say the Matchstick Rocket is incredible. Just take your time to make it right, follow the instructions, and let it fly. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.